First of all, you create an S7 SCL source in the source container of the Step 7 program and then open it with a double click. You can create the necessary code structure very quickly by using the development environment. The code generator automatically generates the code lines required for an FC. The interface of the FC has already been defined conceptually. The array to be sorted is a gateway parameter. Furthermore, a status should be returned. Now we have to implement the sorting algorithm. We will proceed from the outside in. We first create the external for loop and fill this with the necessary variables. Since the entire array is to be seen as unsorted at the beginning, you have to select the appropriate run parameter. Index 1, therefore, must be run here from the upper bound of the array to 1. In this case, the constant max size is the upper bound of the array. The current structure element and the current index can each be marked with one line of code using the assignment operator. Now you need another for loop to find the maximum in the unsorted subarray. This loop starts at the beginning of the array and goes to the end of the unsorted subarray. Index 2, therefore, must run from 0 to index 1 minus 1. You can now use an if statement to determine the value and position of the maximum. Finally, you have to check whether the maximum found is in front of the current value. If it is, then the values have to be swapped. If not, then the maximum is already at the end of the unsorted subarray. The core code lines of the algorithm have thus been implemented. In order to obtain a program with correct syntax, you simply have to add the missing variable declarations. The compiler is now triggered to check the syntax of the S7 SCL source. Any errors are displayed in the output window. You simply double-click the error message to jump to the error location. In this case, a semicolon was missing. Once you have corrected the error, you start the compiler again and the Step 7 block is generated. Now this block can be called multiple times by another block or even by another S7SCL source.